What is your opinion of Kim Kardashian? Uh, she did that. She did that. And I mean, I would be interested in seeing what she's like really as a person, you know, because I know what people put out to the public isn't always what they are or it's not everything they are. And since I'm a Libra as well, I believe she's a Libra, I just, I would be interested in knowing what she's really like. Never met her in person? No, I've never met her in person. I've never even seen her in person. Now, she does have products out. Have you ever had a chance to check out any of her products, own any of her products? No. She's also had fragrances before. Okay. So you, I'm assuming you never smelled any of them no, or purchased any of them. <laughs> no, but she gets into the money. I ain't mad at it. Well, she has a new fragrance out. Okay. I don't know if you've seen this on social media or heard about this. It's called KKW Body. Okay. And uh, it just came out, and I want to get your opinion on it. We actually have a bottle. Okay. Just for you to check out. It's to the side of you. We have it locked up in our mystery box. Now's the time to <laughs> unveil it. So okay. go ahead and grab the mystery box and grab the, the perfume box out of that mystery box and then put the mystery box back down. Okay, this is it. Go ahead and give us a 360 of it. Uh, we pre pre-opened it for you. Uh, it was like really tied up with the string there. Oh, okay. You can probably put the string down, I guess, because the string is like kind of up on the lid there. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, we pre-opened it for you so you wouldn't have trouble opening it. But okay. this is a 360 of KKW body. Uh, at the front, you'll see the center is tied by a string. Um, go ahead and unwrap the string. When you get it and open it for the first time, it's really wound on there. Really? <laughs> now, when you open this box, open it very carefully. Okay. Oh. Pop the lid open. and. Okay. Like I said, oh, 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 whoa, <laughs> whoa. Yes. Can y'all uh, see that? <laughs> it's intricate. <laughs> this is the bottle. I don't think I've ever seen anything before like this. So I opened the box. And this is the bottle? This is the actual bottle, oh, okay. Yeah. Can I take it out? Now? Yes. I'm going to set the box down. If that's Please. Okay. Now go ahead and examine the bottle and uh, give okay. us your opinion on it. Uh, what are you thinking here? This is KKW Body. Uh, it's got good boobs. Those are her boobs. Uh, this is supposed to be just like her body? Yes, it's. Uh, she actually did a cast of her body for this bottle. Oh, okay. She looks a little more hippie on this bottle than in real life. You know what I'm saying? Hippie? But that's a nice body. Her boobs. <laughs> good boobs. Okay. Pop the it's top. Cool. It's kind of... Um, what does that texture feel yeah, like? Yeah, the texture, that's what I was going to say. It's different than any bottle because most of them are glass. This is like, I'm not even sure what the material is, but it is textured, meaning like... Um, like a I stone it, or it's something? It's a little rough, almost like sandpaper, but oh, not okay. really rough. Maybe it is a stone with some flakes of something on it that gives it texture. Mm -hmm. Booty! <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Go ahead and pop the top. Okay. And uh, give us a spritz and a smell, and let's see what you think. I can uh, take this off, too? I don't even know what this is. I don't yeah, know what the purpose of uh, that was. Because it's not full. You know, like, normal lids, they're all the way around. This is not. Is it double lids? Is it two lids? Is well, it? Well, this was just um, cardboard almost, you know, mm -hmm. like paper. But this is Oh, so there's Plastic, an actual lid. Maybe, I guess, but it's not a full cap lid. Do you know how most people <coughs> have a full cap lid? And it has the initials on it, KKW. But it's not all the way around, so. Okay. But I guess you still have to take it off to spray it, so. There we go. I can spray it? Yep. Where do you want me to spray it? Like on myself or on something? Whatever you think. Can I spray it on this and smell it? I think, it on your, I think it's better on your, I think it's better on your, like your arm or something. Because I'm, I'm only asking because I already have perfume on, so I don't want it to take okay, maybe away just do it in the, the maybe scent. just do it in the air, maybe, then right in front of you, I guess. Uh, no, I'll put it. I don't think I have, I don't have any lotion, smelly lotion on my hand, so I'm going to put it on my hand. Because I didn't put um, my perfume there, so. Oh. Let's let it dry a little bit. 
Okay. Is it parfum or? Oh, it is. Okay. Take your time. Give us your honest opinion. I will give you the description in a second, but I want to see what you pick out first. What kind of tones and scents? I don't know. I feel like citrus. It's not very sweet. Like, you know, some perfumes are really uh, sweet. And I actually, I gravitate towards really sweet perfumes. <laughs> but Do we need to do another spritz is, or? Uh, my nose is not that sensitive, but I can, no, I can smell it. it it's. It's light though, it's not a heavy fragrance, even though it's um, parfum and not edit toilet. But it's still light. Um, see, I typically like to smell things after they've dried, so I okay. can really smell like what it would smell like, but just off of this alone, I wouldn't purchase this for myself. I wouldn't want it because like I said, I'm more of a you like the more sweet. sweet. Mm -hmm. Well, let me give you a brief description. You got the citrus part right. Oh, okay. A narcotic elixir, and this is uh, this description is off of uh, kkwfragrance.com where okay. people can get the perfume if they want. While he speaks, you can check out her body. This is the description off the website. A narcotic elixir that offers an opening of bright, energetic bergamot, okay. which is that citrus smell you're talking oh, okay. about, embracing a burst of juicy peach nectar. Oh, peach, okay. Do you smell any peach? I wouldn't pick out peach. Okay, okay. Uh, continuing on. In the heart, the rich lusciousness of jasmine Sam Beck meets the fresh beauty of rose. Mm. I don't know if you have any floral scent there. Elong Elong from Mohili lends texture and depth to the body that eventually drives to a rich and luxurious base of skin woods and musk that keeps... Musk the narcotic effect alive for hours on your skin. Okay. I could see that. The description you just read to me, I could see it as I'm smelling it. Like jasmine. Like I'm not I'm not so good with scents. Okay. <laughs> that I could just be like, oh this, this, this and this and this and this. But uh, while you read it and I was smelling it, I could see all of that. It's nice. I do guess. you do you think this is more of a daytime smell, nighttime smell, anytime smell? See, I'm so open-minded. Like, I just would say that it depends on the person, but maybe more daytime. It's, it's kind of light. What about season? Spring, summer, fall, winter, any season? <laughs> I don't think there's a right or wrong answer, so I don't know why I'm hesitating, but... I would say, for me, uh, maybe like a spring or fall. What about an age bracket? Is this more like a grown woman scent, a uh, young woman scent, any woman scent? I wouldn't put this on like a young, young girl. More grown. Yeah, but not like, not like my mother and her friends. You know <laughs> what I mean? You know what I mean? Not like necessarily that, but somewhere maybe in the she was putting it for her peer group. So maybe somewhere in the middle between not young, not grown, but kind of like in the middle. <laughs> yeah, you know, um, mid twenties. Okay. Early forties. Something like that. I don't know. Now, you like the more sweeter side of things. Um, when it comes to perfumes and fragrances, mm -hmm. are you the type that wears like something different every day, something different with every outfit? Or are you the type that has like one scent and you run it till that bottle's gone? And then maybe you choose a different scent. No, I have multiple and I'll switch it up. And I don't know what makes me want to wear something over another. That's now it makes me feel like I need to go find that out about myself. <laughs> You ever mix fragrances together to create Ooh. a new fragrance smell? No, I have done. What have I done? Okay. My way of doing it might have been putting on a scented lotion and then with the perfume, 
that's still mixing a fragrance even though you're not mixing two of the same type of um, fragrance or avenues of getting the scent. Um, something like that or maybe like a body spray and then a perfume. Something like that. I once met a person that, uh, it was a guy, uh -huh. so it was cologne. Okay. But he said that uh, he mixes his colognes because he doesn't want to smell like anybody else on the planet. Why doesn't he just make his own? I think there's places like in the world that you can go make your own scent. You know what? I don't know if he's, he you even that? thought of that or even knows that exists. Yeah, I, I would encourage him to go do that. What about when it comes to designers? Some designers, uh, clothing designers, they have their own perfume, fragrance, cologne. Okay. Uh, you ever uh, purchased a designer's cologne, I'm uh, not cologne, uh, purchased a designer's perfume in this case, uh -huh. or fragrance, and wore it when you wore their clothes? You ever matched like that oh. all the way through? You're wearing their clothes, you throw on their scent. No, I'm not even really big into designer as far as clothes and things like that, so that wouldn't be for me.